Indian Prime Minister Narendra Modi departed for Russia to attend the 16th BRICS summit in Kazan. Now, in a statement before leaving for Kazan, Prime Minister Modi said that India values the close cooperation within BRICS, which has emerged as an important platform for dialogue and discussion on issues. He added that the expansion of BRICS with the addition of new members last year has added to its inclusivity and agenda for the global good. The summit this year is themed strengthening multilateralism for just global development and security. This year's summit will see participation from BRICS founding members, nations like Brazil, Russia, India, China and South Africa, alongside new members, which includes Egypt, Ethiopia, Iran and the UAE. Leaders are expected to discuss ongoing collaborations and strategize for future projects that promote development and security. Amidst the rising global tensions, all eyes will be on a potential meeting between Indian Prime Minister Narendra Modi and Chinese President Xi Jinping. PM Modi will also meet the Russian President Vladimir Putin. Now, India's Ministry of External Affairs on Monday said that some of the key agendas of the meet include expansion of economic cooperation, trade settlement in national currencies, sustainable development, particularly PM Modi's life mission to address the problems of climate change. As per the EMEA, India and China has also negotiated a patrolling deal along the line of actual control after four years of discussions. Meanwhile, Russia has released 85 Indian nationals from its military camp ahead of the summit. And Beyond's assistant editor for foreign affairs, Siddhan Sibyl, sent us this report. Listen to him. The BRICS summit is all set to begin here in Kazan, Russia. Now, essentially, the big focus will be on payments mechanism, uh, uh, also on the BRICS expansion. We know that uh, there is increased eagerness uh, by many countries across the world to join this grouping, and a new category of membership is being created where uh, the country can be part of new BRICS initiatives. Now, essentially, India, as uh, the founding member of BRICS, has been committed to the organization, and the Indian Prime Minister due to his presence here will not only showcase that but also emphasize as to how the grouping can play an important role at a time when uh, the world order is changing very fast. Uh, all in all for Russia it will be uh, a message to world and especially to the West that amidst their attempt to isolate Moscow Russia has close relationship with the global south. Remember almost uh, 20 to 25 world leaders will be present here in Kazan for the BRICS summit. Not only the core members and the new members, but also invited guest countries. With video journalist Ajit Sadhan Sibyl for Vion in Kazan, Russia. For all the latest news, download the Vion app and subscribe to our YouTube channel.